Right, today we're going to make a video on how to put your guidelines in for your superhero, okay? So we're going to have guidelines that look like this. So we're going to have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 squares like that. And the more lines and squares that you've got, the more accurate your drawing can be. So I'm just going to start off by working on your A5 um, plain drawing paper. So I'm going to use a red bell tip because on your worksheet that some of you may have, it's I've done it with the red bell tip and also the PowerPoint has got the red and blue felt tip. So I'm just going to work with this. And then you can see it on the video also. So along the paper here, it's about 15 centimeters. So make sure the zero, the line, is exactly on the edge of the paper. So half of 15 is um, 7.5. So I'm going to put a line there. I'm going to move this up. So again, zero on the line and then 7.5. Turn this around so you can see. And then join the two dots together. Okay, now we need a line going across. So we're gonna measure this way this time. So zero on the line, so that's about 21 centimeters. I just moved the camera that way. There you go. So it's 21 centimeters approximately. So half of 21 is 10.5. Put a dot, move the ruler to the other side. So it's 10.5. Join the two dots together. There you go. Now, I'm going to use my blue felt tip just to show you where the next lines go. So now we're working with more lines to create more grids. So we're going to do that one going down first. So again, with your ruler, zero on the line, on the edge of the paper, sorry. And then now that, where the, this line is in the middle, mine is red, it's seven and a half. So half of Seven and a half is approximately 3.7. So I'm going to put a line there. Move the zero to the midpoint where, my, where I've got a red line. So again, it's approximately 3.7. We need to do the same measurements at the bottom. So that goes on the edge of the paper, so measurements are three and a half. Move it over to where my red line is, and then it's three and a half again. I'm going to turn it around that way so it fits on the screen for you to see. Join those lines together, and then do the same. on the other side okay so now i'll show you on here again we're going to draw the lines that go across like that okay so what you need to do is again turn the rule around that way zero goes on the top so that is ten and a half so we're looking about uh, 5.2 approximately put a dot there and then I just move my camera down. So again, on the other side, 5.2. Join those two dots together. So you've got four squares there and four squares there. That's eight. So we need to do exactly the same to the bottom bit. So start from this red line, which is halfway point so I said 5.2 move your ruler to the other side 5.2 join the dots together 
there you go you got your 16 squares and that's going to simplify your drawing a lot more now you need to do exactly the same to your superhero okay now on the worksheet that's provided for you if you have one um it's got all the measurements in again and that's what you need to do okay mine's color coded so when you work through your worksheet you'll be able to know what to do first 